that was one season. Three seasons done. Two still. Before any spoilers for Abby Bell's season 3 final, go watch it before you watch this video. I'm going to be talking about the end of the season, so 3, 2, 1. Alright, that should give you enough time to leave. So, Tinker won yet again in Abby Bell's season 3. I did not exactly want him to win. In fact, I did not want him to win at all. But, I'm proud. I mean, congrats to Tinker for winning season 2. Season 3 was so fun, so many new things. At the time of the recording, the final battle hasn't even been found. I'm just, I, I, I was rooting for Creecraft. He didn't win, he got pretty much almost last in the final, but I don't get with that, he tried. Um, he tried his hardest, they all did, the competitors. All the competitors did incredibly well. It's just how fun it's, it's just crazy how fun it's been. And I just realized these books are like, I knew they were 3D, but they're not that We're gonna off topic. So, it's just incredible season. I hope there's a season four. If not, thanks sorry about for such a fun time we've all had. This was a great, great season. All the fun, the collecting of the bids and the badges. I'm just going to tune in to watch our favorite YouTubers compete against each other. It's just been an amazing season. But in the end, it's not the champion that matters, it's not the badges, it's not the UGC, it's not the, the event itself, kind of is, you know. It's the laughs, the friends we made along the way, the fun times we had watching our favorite YouTubers compete against each other. The collecting of the bits, that's not important, but it was important that we had a great time doing this. So, in the end, what really matters is also the message of the story. It's not all that, all that other stuff. It's really a, Arby Battles. It's really about Arby Battles. See, the Arby Battles is really about. It's all about who wins in the end.